Dell Tech Azure provides a process where project managers can complete the invoice review process for very simple invoices directly from within Azure that you don't need to email separate PDFs or um, send paper files back and forth with accounting. So how the process works from the project manager perspective is it's billing week and PMs will log into their project manager dashboard and there will be a invoice review widget. So here we have a draft invoice for this case. And so we want to work on the invoice. So we click preview invoice and it will open up in a screen that looks like this. All right, so let's get our screen situated so we can see what's going on here. So sometimes the screen opens like this and you do not see the notes back and forth with accounting. So always open the review history. And sometimes behind the blue plus, you want to turn on contact, due date, modified, modified by. Attachments does not work the way you think it would, so let's leave that off. And then this part of the screen can be made smaller and larger. That usually when you first turn this on, it's super tiny and you can't see anything. So you want to drag that down to give you some more space. And then in the invoice itself, we have, you know, this is what the invoice would look like once it goes to the client. You know, the draft would disappear and turn into invoice. But then we also have the pre-bill worksheets. And then if you have them turned on, they'll have like the tiny baby timesheets at the end as well. So from this screen, we have a preliminary review of the invoice that's going to go to the client. We have the pre-bill worksheets with all the per charge detail. And so from here, we can start to provide instructions on what to do with the invoice. So typically we will, next step will be, we wanna, we wanna push this back to accounting. Hit select to just push it to accounting. And we're gonna put some sort of note on here that you know the notes could be something simple as like, hey, this draft is good, so bill as it's shown. Or another option would be like, hey, move a couple little things and then invoice the bill or then invoice the project. Or another option is, hey, just hold this. We're not actually going to bill. And then the third option is, you know, once you can see that if you have an invoice and we have to move 30 charges back and forth between seven different projects or different phases, this is not the screen to do that from. That, you know, it would take you all week to type out detailed notes and once you return that back to me, I'm not going to understand if this is just this long list of stuff. So in that case, you can say, hey, you know, I'm going to send annotated PDF or I'm going to print this to paper and I'll drop the paper copy off at your desk. And if you need a PDF or a printed version from Azure, that from here we can pull this down and export this to a PDF to mark up. And then if we hit save, that it will change the status of this bill. So now it's accounting's turn to do something with the invoice. And if it's simple and we're done, that then this will be completed and you won't look at this again. If accounting has more concerns, that then you know the invoice is gonna pop back up. You know, it could be like, you know, accounting's gonna send you notes on And you know, we're gonna send it back to you saying, hey, we don't understand what, what we're supposed to do here. And so once we put this back into project manager review stage, it's gonna appear back on that widget for you. And so from here, you can go back and forth a few times. So let's move this back to accounting. And so let's hit save. And I just wanna go back to this widget and show that you know, it's no longer here because at this point it's accounting's responsibility to take care of the invoice and it's no longer on your radar. So that's a quick overview of how to uh, review and approve invoices from within Azure. Um, keep in mind that if you have a ton of complicated changes, please push the draft and please push the invoice out to PDF or print it and annotate the PDF or the paper copy. And also keep in mind that 
the notes on the invoice screen, the billing review stages, those notes sometimes disappear. So if the invoice is not billed this round, don't expect that those notes are gonna be there for next month, that if you have to keep notes, keep them somewhere else. Thanks, bye-bye.